Hello, hello there guys. This is Terrorantor, and today we're going to start a new season of Terrorantor Plays Minecraft, my single player Let's Play series in a whole new world. A new fantastic point of view. No one to tell us no, or where to go, or say we're only dreaming. A whole new world, don't you dare close your eyes. And I don't actually know if that's how that song goes precisely, but also, oh crap, don't hit me for copyright, Disney, please. Um, but yeah, hey guys, welcome. Oh man, I just, I'm happy to be here. You know what? I stopped recording for a long time because I was busy and crap, and basically I just wasn't feeling motivated. I actually, whew, um, had like minor depression or something, don't worry about it. Uh, but I stopped just feeling motivated in general, like to do basically everything. Um, and I, I could say that, oh man, I wanted to record all along, but I was just so busy. That, that'd be a bit of a lie. I actually, I could have recorded and I didn't because I was just, uh, I was just feeling so crappy and bad for myself and stuff. And I was really pretty much a huge loser. Um, but hey, I decided that, you know what? I'm gonna make time to record, I'm gonna get motivated, because I, I really do enjoy it, like, I really truly do, and I came the whole way up here, just so I could stand at the top of this waterfall, and, uh, and look down across the land, and, oh man, wow, this is a great little spawn here, we start out in a savanna, um, very fitting, although I was probably singing the wrong Disney song, I probably should have chosen a song from Lion King, rather than Aladdin there, but, let's go ahead, uh, let's head out here, and you know what, in the series, ooh, look, a village! Uh, in this series, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do what I feel like, like, ain't nobody tell me what to do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what I want, uh, we're gonna have lots of fun, it's gonna be sort of blog-ish, a little bit of a Far Lands or Bust type of, uh, type of spin on it, just in that I'm gonna talk about, you know, current events, I'm gonna talk about interest me, we started right above a ravine, that is absolutely phenomenal, let's start by heading over to this village, let's see if they have a blacksmith, let's harvest some of the wheat, carrots, potatoes they got in their, in their stuff, we can use that for our starting food in the world. And, oh man, I have not played vanilla Minecraft just for fun in such a long, long time. Uh, oh, look, a blacksmith. That is delightful. I really hope they have a farm, though. It's like, this is a rare, rare case. Oh, there it is. Perfect, right over there. Where I actually, I was hoping to have a farm more than a blacksmith. Um, and, oh man, some bread, some apples, and an iron chest plate. That is awesome. Take an inventory achievement in the bank. Um, yeah, so this is gonna be, uh, just, I'm so excited to have this going. And I hope that night falls soon, because I have a plan, uh, with how we're gonna get our, our wood in this series. I've decided I'm never gonna punch a tree. Because that, my friends, is unrealistic. And I know what you're thinking, you're thinking, if you're looking for realism, why are you playing Minecraft? And no, I'm not really looking for realism. I just, I just thought it would be fun to, instead of, uh, punching a tree to start out here, we're gonna have a, uh, a creeper blow up a tree for us. I'm sure if you can hear that dog barking in the background. I do have my window open. Uh, I could close it to reduce a little bit of background noise, but then it would be very, very hot in here. Very hot indeed. Uh, I do live in beautiful Colorado where it's been pretty cold recently, but I don't know. Something, something's been off, and it's been pretty freaking warm, uh, at least right where I live. For at least a couple of well, I mean, I guess yesterday we had a huge snowstorm. But other than that, other than that, it's been very warm. Um, yeah, though, we have to wait for night to fall. We have to get a creeper. We're going to get a creeper to blow up our first tree. And that's how we're going to get some wood to start off the, the series here. Huh, huh. And parkour. Oh, yeah, nailed it. <laughs> had to get over here to make myself some bread. <clears throat> Man, here I am trying to punch down a tree. And it just isn't working. If only I had an axe or some high-powered explosives, I could probably get this wood easy peasy. If only there were some sort of mobile creature that would explode violently. Hmm. Unfortunately, I don't think there are any creatures like that in Minecraft. None whatsoever. Oh look at these strange green fellows. I wonder if they are friendly. Come over here, strange green fellows. Oh crap, darn it, too many and a spider. Okay, alright, alright, I can deal with this. I can deal with this. Let's eat the bread. Let's eat the apple. And then let's punch the spider to death. Get over here, spider. Oh, oh man, I'll get the creeper to blow up the spider for me. Yeah, creeper, come on over here. Oh, got him. 
Okay, now let's get this last creeper. Ooh, I am. I might die. Uh, that would be unfortunate. Num, num, num. Hey, hey, you. Hey, buddy, I need some wood. Come on, come on, I don't got all day. Oh, darn it. Ooh, did it drop any? Oh, I got a piece. Oh, yeah. Oh, check it out. Who needs freaking, uh... Huh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have to get in this house. Huh. Who needs to punch down trees when, you, when you're as good as me? All right, let's, uh, let's go ahead. First thing first here, I'm going to make myself a sword for self-defense because I don't actually have enough wood to make myself an axe, which is something I really need. Uh, but hey, I can defend myself now. What the, what the F? Oh, I couldn't eat the carrot there. I was right-clicking. Oh, I was full of food. Oh, duh. All right, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Let's try to get another creeper going. Hey, you. Buddy. Hey. Oh, oh, too good, too good. That guy didn't stand a chance. Creeper, hey you, hey you, bro. Get yourself over here. Mm-hmm. And now I can actually block his blast. Whew. And there it is. Oh, yeah. Now I can make myself an axe. Then I can actually chop down some trees in a semi-realistic fashion. Oh, wow. I don't know. I just wanted to do that in Minecraft for a long time, you know? As an alternative to, to punching down trees. Oh, crap. This is a tough jump. Um, yeah, though. I'm gonna make myself an axe. I can, I can actually get some materials and stuff now. And, oh, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sleep through the night here. I'm getting a little... <clears throat> a little tired from all of this exploding and, and spiders and stuff. So, uh, I'm just gonna take a quick nap. Hmm. I think that this this food labeled rotten flesh is probably very good for you. Hmm. Mm, gauging the taste, gauging the flavor. You know, yeah, that tastes that tastes good to me. That tastes healthy. Uh, I'm gonna take this crafting table. This is mine now. Uh, no, nobody lives in this house. Clearly, look. I mean, how could a villager even get up here? I I can't imagine. Also, I'm gonna take a a book. Gotta gotta have a good reading book for the road. Oh. Or three, or three, that's fine. Yeah, though, I used my axe to, uh, to go ahead axe a couple of zombies some questions, if you know what I mean. Haha, <laughs> I'm saying I killed him. No, I'll help you. No. Oh my god, did they kill him? Oh my god, they killed him. Um, yeah, I've been, I've been trying to protect him, but he's all over here. He's like, hey, I'll give you an axe for you. Yeah, there you go. They're trying to protect the villagers a little bit, but uh, but they are very prone to death. It's like one of their favorite things. Um, dang it, I keep I keep trying to take damage, but there's not really much I can do about it. I'm gonna go ahead and gonna make myself another sword and uh, a pickaxe and stuff, and and then we can we can get on our way. It's a square sun rising over the land and the spider gonna die I get some string it's a square sun rising over the desert burn you dick yeah that's right I'm talking oh look I got a bow ring a ding a ding a ding a ding ding Alright man, I'm gonna get hit so hard for copper. I need to stop this. I just can't I I have a song in my heart and I need to let it out. That's all there is to it, folks. Uh that guy's got a, a little cactus here. Good for you, good for you. Uh let's go ahead. Oh no! Poor guy, look at that. He stepped on the cactus a little bit. You know what? This Enderman and I, we're bros. He and I, bros for life. Um let's go ahead. Let's go down a little bit. Let's let's uh let's go down underground maybe just uh uh down under like uh, 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 uh what am I trying to say? Wait a minute! Wait a minute! I can I can, I can think through these words. Let's go down just a little bit, a little bit. That's what I'm trying to say. Not very far down, a little bit down. Um, and would you look at this? I actually have a bow. And an arrow already, accidentally. All I've crafted so far have been a couple of really, really basic tools. 
but um, but I'm doing all right. I'm doing all ha 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 right. Uh, boop. Let's go ahead. Let's find that awesome ravine we saw earlier. Yum 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 yum. yum. Actually, let's start right here. Let's start right here. The villagers already have a little bit of a quarry going. I'll help them dig this out. They're probably gonna put their community bathhouse down here or something, or maybe they're trying to dig down to the to the hot springs. Um, but let's help them out a bit. Let's just let's dig this out. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, villagers. I got it. Oh man, this is this is good. This is good. Wait, so you're saying I just I just pull back? Like, wait. Like this? Oh, 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 I'm sorry. Die, sheep, die. <laughs> ah, yes, the great sheep massacre of a villager. Oh, speaking of villager town, actually, I was, <laughs> I was driven out. I, uh, I accidentally shot a guy kind of in the... I don't know, roughly speaking, in the face region, I, I guess that's what you'd call it. Um, and yeah, they weren't too happy about that, so I'm, <laughs> I'm out here on my own. The sky is all clouded over, and I think it might start raining soon. So I'm going to get down underground. Deep, I'll just go way down here, actually. Um, I think it's safe. I'm pretty sure I read in a book somewhere that... If you go underground, you are guaranteed to find a village of the uh, mole people and that they will protect you. It's just like kind of part of their of their villager way to like protect those weaker than them. So let's head on down here. Let's invoke the ancient law of the mole people. Let's go ahead um, oh, and a boop. Oh, dang. I was trying to fall and like place that beneath me as I fell. Let's make myself a better pickaxe. And a better sword. Um, just so that I, I can defend myself. Just in case I have trouble finding the mole people, you know. Uh, this might help me out a bit. Let's go get that coal over there. And, oh no, I only got two wool. I thought I killed, I thought I killed three sheep. Oh, dang it, I'm going to need another one for a bed. Um, it's fine, though. I'll take care of that later. Uh, for now, though, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hunt for the mole people. And, uh, and I'll, s you know what, I will start, t I I'll start recording again when I find the mole people. Look at that, look at how deep down that goes. Like, there is where I came in. That probably goes down, like, to freaking the out, like, layer 12. Like, that's probably lava layer down there. Wow. No mole people yet. I have yet to see any mole people, but, uh, but I did get some iron. I got, uh, look, uh, some more coal. I made myself some torches. I'm running a little low on, low on food, and honestly, I am just, I'm just shocked I haven't found the mole people yet. Like, when I talked to Tim, the guy, you know, the guy who told me about the mole people, he said they would be, like, right there, like, right underground. Um, so, I don't know. I don't know about Tim. He might have lied to me about the mole people. I'll, I'll spend a bit more time looking, but I'm starting to get a little bit uh, suspicious, I guess, of his advice. And I just did finger quotes there. In case you, you, you know, you couldn't, like, uh, use your scrying orb to, to watch me do those. Hmm. Well, we'll see. The Great Sheep Aww. Massacre, part two. Die! <laughs> oh, good. That was a good one. That was, that was solid. Um, let's go chop down a little bit more wood around here so I can make myself a bed. Let's just, let's just chop down this whole tree. This whole tree. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh. oh, hey guys, what what are you doing sitting around my bed? Oh. 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 Oh crap. Um alright guys, turns out that, that tree I chopped down was in fact the uh the life tree that these villagers worship. So um Huh. Awkward. <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? Uh -huh. Oh god. Hey there, guys. This is Tim. <laughs> you remember Tim, right? The Tim. Hey, Tim, come back. You're on TV. Uh -huh. Yeah, this is Tim, the guy who uh, who uh -huh. lied to me about the mole people. Uh -huh. Yeah, he seems to think it was just a joke, but uh -huh. but hey, Tim, you know what? Uh -huh. 
Nobody lies to Terraranta, all right? Nobody. Nobody. You sent me underground? I'm gonna send you underground. You got that? Hey, down the hole. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right. Um, some people may say that I am really bad at taking a joke. No. No, I think that was uh, completely reasonable. Yeah, unfortunately, pretty much all of the villagers are dead. Uh, I... I shot the one in the face. That was... that was unfortunate. Um... I... I may have also accidentally... Uh, had like two fall down that hole while I was digging it. I... I pretty much killed all of them, actually. Um... Except for two. Two who died by zombie. First, I was going to protect them. But then, you know, between... <laughs> Between shooting and the killing and and the destroying the tree that they think of as their god, uh, our relations, you know, the relations between me and the villagers, they were a little strained. And I decided maybe it would be best if we just like decided, you know, like, hey, let's not be friends, kind of keep a distance from one another. Um, yeah, so I killed I killed a bunch of them uh, because you know if you're not friends. You're pretty much enemies, right? Am I right? <laughs> and and now I'm gonna disembowel their village for all of its resources uh, that it has to offer here. I'll leave the farm up, but I'll, I'm gonna use it as my own private farm. And if I see any villagers walking on it, I will not hesitate to kill them. Um, yeah, again, you know, some people would consider me a little harsh here. Uh, I don't think so. I don't. I think I'm being reasonable in all this. I think I'm being reasonable. Here we have the last villager. You know what, buddy? I'm gonna let you live. I'm gonna let you sit here all by your lonesome when all of your friends and relatives have died. That's right. I will not let you die. I will force you to wallow in your own self-pity for the rest of your pathetic existence, you piece of garbage! Alright, so let's go ahead. Let's, uh, let's go start building a house, I think. It is getting kind of dark out. Um, and, and I do want to build at least a little bit of just kind of a rudimentary house before we go down underground and we really start exploring the bottom of that cave. Uh, I just stayed up on the ledge and I just grabbed some of the iron and stuff that was like readily available. Um, but now that we have pretty much destroyed an entire population of villagers and stuff, we've done some really good work so far in this new world. Um, so yeah, let's, let's go ahead. Actually, I think this might be time to wrap up the first episode. Uh, but next time, we'll build a house, we'll do some mining, and we can really get started on, on all the fun stuff. So hey, thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, leave a like. If you'd like to see more videos, like it, leave a subscribe thingy. If you have any questions or comments, please uh, leave a comment. Or, oh crap, how did my outro go? Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, leave a like. If you'd like to see more videos, like it, leave a subscribe thingy. If you have any questions or comments, please leave a comment or send me a message. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I will see you next time. Terrorantor is out of here.